Hey there everyone, how's it going? It's me, Shari Mustafis here with yet another speed art video. And today we're back in Clips, Clip Studio Paint and we're painting, or right now we're sketching and finally using one of my favorite new tools, which is the Symmetry tool. I mean, it's been around in the program, but I'm new to this. This is like really mind blowing. I love how I can just rough out, sketch out uh, Master Chief's helmet. Speaking of Master Chief, uh, last week, uh, Halo Infinity, Infinite, or the new Halo games trailer came out and as you guys know I've been playing a lot of Halo on my gaming channel if you guys are interested in that there's a link in the description below to all the channels you can follow me on and as well as my social media is plugging in there if you guys are interested needless to say uh, just a quick little painting demo of a uh, of a uh, uh, just uh, using a clip studio paint CSP as I'm gonna call it from now on because it's a mouthful to say needless to say and I'm just blown away by the symmetry tool. I mean, I see it in a lot of uh, phone app drawing programs, but you know, it was weird that I could never find it or do it easy, find an easy way to do this in Photoshop. And it's, uh, you know, drawing the Spartan helmet that Master Chief wears is, it's a pretty symmetrical helmet, needless to say. And it's probably lends itself to its design and from its time from when games were very angular if we go think back to Halo 1 and Halo 2 on the original Xbox. Needless to say, it's just my usual workflow, uh, putting down base colors, putting down my base tones, everything is muted at this point. And then the new thing that I was new to using in this program is, which is uh, the loop fill tool, which is, um, it's like a loop, you just like use your selection whip tool that you would use for Photoshop, but here it's like you immediately just fill your colors so I'm just going in flying in sure I spent an hour trying to refine the drawing and the painting at the end of the day because I just really wanted to really quickly post this up on Instagram if you haven't followed me on Instagram or Twitter at satmustafishaw if you if you're wondering needless to say it's just a really cathartic feeling of just going in and just painting and inking things in and painting back and forth and uh, on the right, I've started to try and get into a better habit of creating a proper color palette, so I don't, I'm not running around in the the, the color selection tool, trying to do my best in emulating the colors. Needless to say, it's it's interesting. Now, at one point, I did turn off the symmetry tool because I wasn't, I didn't need it. I needed to start putting in my darker values and my highlights in on from one side, so you'd get that sense of depth. And I'll go in in a little bit in a few areas where I felt like it was a little too rough, and then I'll go in with a watercolor tool. Honestly, you know, at this point, I'm still using the, the default brushes. I mean, I'm really impressed by this program. And if you guys are interested, I'm thinking about doing a tutorial series on how to get started with digital art. And you know, I can probably do it on Photoshop and Clip Paint, Clip Studio Paint. And but that's up to you guys if you want to know how to do that or if you want me to start that tutorial series um, you can express that opinion down in, in, uh, in the comments below and like I say um, every single after every single video I will f feature any comment I mean if it's appropriate of course in the next video uh, we haven't been getting a lot we have we've been getting a lot of views from actually non subscribers and I'd like to see more interaction and we're slowly growing growing steadily on this channel which is awesome and needless to say uh i'd like to see more interaction from you guys is what should i draw next what should it be an art tutorial should i return to doing my 3d printing videos or doing whatever like i said this is like a whatever channel and posting my art is kind of like my fo focus right now and learning this new program is really amazing i mean i'm blown away but as an as a as a daily illustrator myself and also it has animation in it, so I've yet to play around with the animation features on this program, but um, and even probably do a web commenting feature as a commission, I'm not sure. But as you guys can see, we're nearing the end, and I'm trying to base this helmet off off of the one in the trailer that we see Master Chief wearing. And I know a lot of people have expressed polarizing opinions about the graphics being the motive for the trailer, but honestly, it's a work in progress string. Uh, I've never Unlike most of the fandom, I haven't doubted 343 Studios, the guys who took over after Bungie left to go make uh, Destiny. Um, I love Halo, you know, it's one of my first games that I started playing when I was a kid, watching my cousins play on the original Xbox, and now I'm playing it back on PC, and I'm pretty sure I mentioned earlier that I have a gaming channel, and a Twitch channel as well. All the links are in the description below. Now, unfortunately, 
OBS stopped recording on me because I'm running out of hardware space, but this is the pretty much the finished face picture that I uploaded on Instagram and as well as my Deviant Art account. Check those out. Like I said, all the links are in the description below. Okay, so if you made it this far, leave a comment, but do consider subscribing. If you've done so already, leave a comment below and then hit that like button. If you haven't done so already, hit that notification bell. And I will see you in the next one.